Eastern Conference Rules and Semi League by ESLB. I would expect a lot of games to come out this that came out this year to release on the Xbox Series X and X and PS5. Considering that it is a cross generational year, I still wish they delayed the next generation to 2021, but I think I did do kind of see why it was a good decision because the virus, who knows how long the virus will actually last, who long, how long will the vaccine actually come, all those questions here, it's October, they said there'll be one by October, but it's still October and there's none, none here, there's supposed to be one by November, won't be surprised there's none by November, because vaccines do take a year, do take at least a year of time, so... Most of the year's big for probably four games will be coming out both current and next gen consoles, but I'll crash by coop for about time. The game that's launched on PS4 and Xbox One. <laughs> Excuse me, I didn't want to, you know, yeah. You know what. But yeah, the launch on PS4 and Xbox One. Xbox has said whether the game will come to Series X or at PS5. Well, ESB may have spoiled the surprise. So if you see the SB rain, there was an Xbox Series X rain and a PS5 rain. And of course, the fantasy history of the places in the fact that the game is only on PS4 and Xbox One, it makes sense that the game will get a next gen port, considering it's a quite it's, it's the, it's the next generation is coming out. It'll be interesting what the developers Toy Bar might do with a next gen version of Crash 4, considering it's a very simple art art style. And I've run a 120 FPS mode by BF Hospital. Having been keeping up with Crash Bandicoot 4, here's the key features here. If you want to read them, so yep, that means there will probably be next gen versions of Crash 4. We don't know, they didn't mention a Switch version, which is completely odd. Maybe there might not be a Switch version, but I think there will be a Switch version. The, I bet Nintendo made so it has to be didn't put their version on there. I won't be surprised if there's a Switch version coming out next year. And yep, that's basically it. Goodbye. Or maybe a Switch Pro version, you never know.